What's up guys, welcome to my channel for a product review. So for today's video, I'll be reviewing the SOG Spirit Spear and Blade, which you can get on Amazon for about $24.99 or so. And as a disclaimer, there is an affiliate link in the description box below. So if you do click it and make a purchase, I'll receive a small compensation for it, which that will be contributed to my channel to acquire better products to review for you guys. So with that being said, let's go ahead and take a look at this thing. So this is the box when you first receive it. As you can see, my box does have a little damage because I've been storing it, been waiting to make a review video for you guys. But I'm not too worried that it didn't really affect the product itself. As you can see, the little SOG emblem imprinted here on the blade. And if you turn it on the side, you can still see the SOG spirit emblem there. Some specifications for you guys, 10.65 inches in length. I'm assuming that's the overall length because it is pretty long. And nylon sheath, weighs about 10 ounces. And that's pretty cool. Lifetime warranty. So if anything happens to it, I'm assuming you can contact the company and they'll take care of you. I'm not really too sure on how that works. Never really needed to yet. And on the back here, it does have some descriptions about the different parts of the product itself like number two here it says removable spearhead attaches to broom handle or branch once we take this product out of the box I'll go ahead and show you that on what it looks like in two separate pieces here's what the sheath looks like I'll also show you that as well and a little bit more specifications down here at the bottom so the blade obviously it is a spear so yeah the blade length is 4.25 inches overall length is 10.65 inches it weighs about 10 ounces the blade steel is 420 rc 5153 now i'm not too really sure what that means i apologize guys i'll look it up and i'll state it in my next video even though it may be a little confusing because this is the video for it right now and glass reinforced nylon handle hard case black finish sheath included and it is also a tactical spear oh my camera lost focus there you go so it is also a tactical spear so that's pretty pretty cool i find that amazing so that's what the box is um and you have your little warning here obviously like most of the products today this product contains chemicals known to the state of California to cause cancer, birth defects, or other reproductive harm. So, that's the box right here. Let me go ahead and open this baby up. And let's take a closer look at the blade itself. So here we have the box. Let's go ahead and open it. At the top right here, you just pull this out. And right there. So we don't really need the box, we can put that aside for now. And as you can see, it comes in a plastic casing to protect the spear and blade. Also in the back, it does have the sheath. So just like that, put this down, take a look at the sheath real quick. So it, it is pretty sturdy, pretty reliable. You can see the SOG patch sewed on here. Also buttons up here if you want to fasten it once the spear is inside so close that I'll show you what it looks like when we put the spear in also you have the big loop here if you want to put it a belt through it if you want to hang it on the side I'm not going to show you what that looks like because I'm actually just wearing shorts right now so it wouldn't really work out too well but that's that now let's go ahead and take this out there will be tape here when you first receive it brand new. I like I said I opened it already to check it out. And there's no tape for me. Well, it's not sticking. So yeah. So here is what the blade looks like up close. The SOG emblem right there. Pretty nice. It's flat on there, so it's not really raised engraved. But it's pretty much imprinted on there. 
little grooves right here if you want to tie rope I'm assuming to make it like throwing I would assume that is what it is and they have a little nice plastic protector here for the point take that off real quick you can see how pointy that thing is it is pretty sharp I like the finish on the edges here with the silver trim and then the back side as well you can still see some oil grease there from when I first got it I never really cleaned it I think I probably should so on the box it said you can turn it into a spear if you attach it to a broom so right here this little crease right here you just simply grab it and start turning it out and this is what the bottom part looks like so if you put the broomstick on here you won't really need this so we can put that aside and I'm just gonna be really careful real quick oh the plastic part fell off so this thing actually falls off pretty quick so if you do get it be sure you don't lose this thing you kinda wanna have that so anyways so I don't know if you can really tell in the camera but there are some threadings in there to put a broomstick I've actually never tried putting the broomstick in there because I never really found one that would fit but I'm assuming there are some broomsticks where you can actually just screw it in because the sticks have threadings also I, I really want to check that out if you guys do own this and you guys do put the broomstick in here go ahead and comment that below or send me uh, pictures through Instagram or Twitter I would love to see that to see how that looks like and to simply just to make it whole again screw it on so when you screw it back on I make sure it's tight but not too tight where it gets stuck but not too loose where it just comes off but yeah I'm actually planning on using this for my backpacking gear I have a lot of tools for my backpacking gear so this might just replace something maybe have multiple uses for this so right off the bat I can say that I like how it feels it's not too light it's not too heavy it's a pretty sturdy spear and it's built with quality now I say this myself because this is my first SOG spear that I have owned or SOG gear in general and I'm really amazed on the type of build I have here it's really good quality so enough of that let's go ahead and put these two together so just unbutton that at the top I'll go ahead and tilt it this way for you guys now I don't know if you're supposed to store it with the plastic thing I do it just in case so it doesn't ruin the threading down here just simply oops sorry guys so just simply put it in like that fits nice and snug there and if you do want to fasten it just go ahead now this is one of the cons I found for myself I don't know it's just me having the personal issue with this or it's in general but I say it's not really a con but a good thing because at least this thing is not going to go anywhere this fastens it down pretty well and as you can see just like that so you put your belt loop through here hang it on the side something like that all right now this is where I had the issue the very first time I put it into the sheath. When I first received the product, I would pull out the spear, like about right here, and it would get stuck. And my theory is, because of the pointy edges here, it kind of tugs on the threads. Now I don't know if you can actually tell in the camera but there is some thread missing right here and it kind of tugs on it and I guess that's just 
when you pull it out but now it comes out smooth so I guess it's just not too big of an issue anymore but like I said I won't be having this on my side and pulling it out in and out every now and then when I use it I'm just gonna have it part of my gear or probably just keep it at home because I do like collecting different types of blades as well so I'll go ahead and put this in for now let me go ahead and put that so it's kind of like this same thing I mean we all know how to use a sheath or I'm assuming so if you're watching this video so just button that up all right this is how it looks again with it so my overall opinion of this product is that I am very satisfied especially that it is my first SOG gear that I own personally and I've actually heard good things about this brand that they are reliable for their products and now I can finally agree with it because I actually own one now and I am satisfied also because of how it was built it's pretty solid it looks reliable or it feels reliable it's not cheaply made it's built with quality same thing with the sheath so just all around it's pretty good to have and I'm actually planning on putting this towards my backpacking gear probably put this in there and take out some of the old or not old but take out some of the other tools and just have this one there instead so if you guys like collecting blades or you know like weapons just to, for display we're actually going to use it for outdoors like backpacking like myself I would recommend this product I would recommend this specific one because it's pretty good it's not too big it can be compact so yeah go ahead and check that out remember I included the affiliated link in the description box below so if you do click it just remember I will receive a small compensation if you do purchase it but I will use that to contribute to my channel to acquire better gear to review for you guys so we have come to the end of this video and if you have enjoyed the review remember to give this video a thumbs up also subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications so you know when my next video becomes available you can also follow me on instagram and twitter using the links in the description box below which allows you to be aware of any new arrivals for videos i also do vlog videos which those will be coming soon as well also comment down below what products you guys would like me to review i'll be happy to try and acquire those products and review them for you and remember if you also have put this spear onto a broomstick i would love to see those pictures go ahead and tweet me in them on twitter or direct message me on instagram thank you guys again for watching and I'll see you guys next time.